what's up guys, it's Skinnery here. Well, back for another gameplay, or random gameplay in War Thunder. So, today, we are going to be playing the uh, IS-2. Well, it's not going to really, really be too random. Um, I think I'm just going to more talk about the, uh, basically, the new BR changes. And how I do and do not like some of them. So the first ones I do like is moving the IS-1 down um, and also moving the Sherman Jumbo. Now I haven't played the Sherman Jumbo but I know at the old BR I was sniping that thing with Tigers and it wasn't really too good. So now it's at 4.7 it's um, I was playing some 4.7 um, British earlier or the other day and I was actually well ricocheting off it and it was very hard to destroy it now again it is still pretty easy to destroy from the side but from the front it's basically a steel wall um, the next thing that's also pretty nice that they've done is um, some of the rounds have been tweaked um, the T-34 has been pushed up a little bit and the um so now you well aren't getting wrecked by T-34s as much but the one thing I do not know why they did it was move the IS-2 down um the IS-2 1944 um is going to be the main one I'm going to talk about is already pretty darn OP it's got a great gun for its BR, it's got fairly good penetration, you can penetrate the front of a King Tiger. But, well, no, they they moved it down. So, now it isn't as high as it used to be. Um, oh, I only got its track. Um, I'm also using a sound mod, I'll have to link that down in the description, if I remember to. So we are bouncing quite a few rounds here. We are will back up while we finish our reload. We are bouncing rounds like this no tomorrow. We did get, a, I think, a little bit of shrapnel inside the group compartment. I think that lower ammo rack seems a little bit different, but uh, doesn't really matter. Um, the machine gun is damaged though. Oh, I didn't get him again. So. They, uh, I think they did change this round a little bit too. Um, I am noticing it isn't penetrating as much as it used to. Um, we'll wait here while we reload. Um, just reload up. But it did hit his barrel. Okay, I do not know where that tiger is. I hit his barrel right in the barrel. Why am I just keep on hitting barrels? What's going on today? I was like drawn to the barrel. Oh, hello there. Give him the wiggles. Give him the wiggles. And you get wrecked, son. So the round is still pretty OP though. So, you know, just one shot inside of a tank and it's still fine. So we're just going to wait here while we reload. Can shoot through this house of that King Tiger, P. He, um, he doesn't have a lot of turret armor. But what he does have is a big throbbing 88. <laughs> um, I see my team is getting wrecked. And for some reason, if only one kill, I'm top of team. But I'm surprised they aren't just coming and flanking us from the side. Um. Oh, he hit his top. We'll back up. We'll reload. Oh, another tiger one. He's 
Tiger 1 spammers. Oh, M18 out of the middle of nowhere. Gets us from the side, I believe. Yes, from the side. It's okay. We have anti air. For some reason, that's all I'm ever really getting is anti air. I don't know why, but it's just me. Like, even though I get a kill, I can't spawn in any. Oh, I can spawn in the D3485. I almost was blind. Um. So, this was moved up to 5.7, so you will be facing Panthers in it. Um, I do believe that you shouldn't be pa facing Panthers in a T-34. It's only got 45mm of hull armor, while a Panther has 80. And the turret armor is only 90mm, while the Panther has 100mm at the front. Actually, 120mm strip. And the Panther's gun penetrates more. Now, it is a lower caliber, and I believe this is slightly more maneuverable. But, really... This shouldn't be facing Panthers. You definitely have to A, have a pretty good shot and shoot right in the front of the turret. Or B, you have to be really lucky to bounce around. So yeah. But people always complain it's too OP. They bitch about it. I don't think it's OP. And I think at 5.3 it was fine. You can destroy it with the Sherman 76. So the enemies are capturing over here. There you go, you're wrecked. So you do get those odd one-shot kills. There is a Hellcat over here. You'll want to deal with him. Um. Anyway, in real life, these things will just be spammed at the enemy and usually get picked off pretty quickly. Oh, hello there. So you failed. So do we have three kills? Um, but it seems I only have an AA to support me. And... KV-2 and a T-34, but I have no clue where they are. Yeah. Hello, I did get bombed. We'll try to shoot him down. Um, we'll wait for the spawn, thank you. I suck at AA. Oh, hey -oh. That was a pretty good shot. Um. Hello. Where did he go? That was pretty scary. I just got strafed. Oh, there he is. Why am I not hitting him? There's a German tank behind me. It's a Tiger One, so I'm really fucked if it, I even decides to look at me. Hey, oh, get wrecked. I got my gunner. Oh, we did 
get shot. Seems to be two tanks there, but something special I can spawn in. T44 and you'll have one hell of a nice try at trying to kill me. We only have the APHE. We missed. But the T-34 got him. T-34 is going ham right now. Hello. So did get defeated. Did knock that guy out last second though. That was pretty good. Um. So yeah, I will just quickly show some of the more BR changes that I knew should have, have happened. Um, I think the IS-2 BR change shouldn't have really happened. Stuff that should have happened, these ones. These ones should have happened a long time ago. Um, what else? On the Germany, Panther 2 shouldn't have been changed. That was pretty good where it was. Um, I don't know why the Coelian and that, those are switched. Those sh shouldn't have been switched. Coelian's a great anti-air. And that is a great anti-air. Those should have been the same BR the whole time. Um, I think those, those should have been in here at 3. Oh, at rank 4. Um, the Tiger E, that was great being dropped down a little bit. Um, the Panzer 4 H, that was okay, that's now, no, it's still 4.3. Um, I think these, these two tanks here need to be dropped down to, like, 4.3. At 4.7 you are versing Hellcats quite a bit, so, those, I think, do need to be dropped. Um, this was moved up a little bit, that was awesome. Now it's at that, because... You aren't really getting downranked to see like these sometimes, which I have seen. Um, what else is pretty good that has been changed? Um, this this is great. Uh, the jumbo has been moved down. This one needs to be still moved down. I'm fairly sure that was moved down. Um, what else was moved down? The M18 was put up a little bit. But the hull break mechanic basically makes that useless. So now you just one shot it and it's dead. Um, yeah, there wasn't too much under Britain. Britain wasn't too much. I think the tortoise needs its multi layered OP armor and needs to be put at like where the Conway is. <laughs> that would be that would be great at 7.0 if you had the more old armor set up. That would have been great. So yeah, I think that still needs to be taken down a little bit, put down a little bit. So there was some great changes, which was nice. Um, so if you guys uh, like the video, make sure you guys slap a like on it. If you guys dislike the video, feel free to put a dislike dislike on it. If you guys really like the video, make sure you guys can subscribing, uh, subscribing should really work on that. My English. And if you guys uh, would want to comment in the description, if you guys want, I don't know anything. Or this uh, my channel's that small. There's no real answer why I should ask for comments, but hey. So yeah, I guess bye.